Holy. Thank you. 
German bullshit. Take a what is I was writing. But uh was pa part of my time you were in the hospital order. So I was sort of waiting for you to come in. Because he told me he said, Oh, my mother no boy or check up or something. I said, Oh no. Billy <coughs> wasn't here to see it all. To see all uh the tech. Tech up man is
uh, hui with uh, 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 Morris Baker at uh, Taheke Marae. Just briefly, what it was for was Pori uh, Tikuri and his uh, ancestors uh, or his descendants uh, that I was hoping would come uh, and um, see what that was about. But I discovered a few more things while I was there uh, with the uh, memorial that's up there with all the whakapapa on it. Uh, I found it rather odd because it's got no date on it, but it's got all the whakapapa on it. Um, and closest to uh, 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 Te Kuri uh, Memorial. And his memorial is, is not uh, being looked after. It's just sitting there with muscle over it. And I thought, now no one's vis visiting him, but the other one has uh, a Ruka and, uh, um, um, oh, I just forgot what the other name, what are they? Um, but the other uh, uh, memorial, it's just plaque, uh, no one's buried underneath that memorial. And that's connected to the uh, uh, mission house uh, uh, in Manganunu, where the uh, treaty was actually signed, and not in Waitangi. This is what I find quite odd, because I've never been to this marae, out of all the uh, Ngāpui marais I've been to, uh, I've always thought it was signed in Waitangi. Not so. Uh, so that's the history I found from some of the locals. The more I, uh, I, I talk to others there, the more I found out um, what was the real story. Now, it's ironic that uh, Jerry Mataparai uh, was sent off from there in the mission house uh, to, uh, to be the ambassador for New Zealand and not Waitangi, where he's been applying uh, his, uh, his trade there uh, selling the lands of New Zealand uh, with the other governor generals. So I know how that works. And uh, now I've, I see that all the whakapapas on the uh, uh, memorial, I'll be putting out a YouTube on that so you can see what I was saying on the top of a hill, uh, speaking uh, there with uh, Hori Tikuri. I was waiting for all the other descendants, chiefs, to come there and claim him. It just happens that Morris Baker was there to claim him, and uh, not much else, uh, apart from uh, uh, Timmy Heiner, that there was nobody else. And so we, we had the hui uh, uh, that fashion, and uh, went down to the church, uh, Manahi, uh, put a, a hui on there uh, to bless the documents uh, we put together for Horitikuri to take to Westminster. I've been finding the last link uh, to the history of that uh, Tupuna and uh, his uh, uh, titles. Those are the deed titles for the whole area uh, in one big block and with Rewherewha Manukau from Afitu in his, uh, uh, his Manukau Marae on the south end of the lookout into the Manukau Harbour and to his Pupunga Marae Cornwallis, uh, Cornwallis in uh, Huya above the hill there, the other part side uh, of Refa Refa Manikau. And then I. Hey? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yes. Uh, oh, is there people going to ask questions or you want me to carry on a little bit more?
to talk a little bit. Yes, yeah, yes. So all, uh, all I'm saying is, my Rogan family uh, and the Cosgrove family put all the titles together. That's paper, not the land. Paper that made money out of all the land and all his resources. That's where I'm coming from. They have used the Whakapapa as a title to accumulate the wealth that's gone the other way to the elite, not to the hapu. And so I'm being pushed off my land at home on 25 blocks. I can't even get on one of them. And because I'm not... Where do you say home? Where do you say home? Where do you say home? Potikirua, Potikirua ki Waipu. That's Waipu, Tiki Tiki, Te Aradoa, to Potaka, to Cape Runaway, all that area up to Raukumara and Hikurangi Mountain. And in particular, the uh, uh, native courts that were set up in the Auckland province. I'm going back to that era when the commerce started making money out of the land and tie here and there and put titles on it. So the king put his title on first and then the queen came along and put her titles on from Australia. There's two sets of titles. The British title and the New South Wales title. The title there with the Papa on it is the New South Wales New Zealand government title, but the titles I have of deeds, the first titles, the big blocks before they got cut up, those are the deeds that are British. Those are the titles my ancestors, the White Rogans from Ireland, put together. And that's what I'm going back to find who put what where on whose bit of land that no one can uh, get off to discharge mortgages. They're stuck there. And so I'm the one to remove them. I've picked out uh, Morris's blocks. He's got 10 blocks back off the crown and they can't get rates out of him because he's sitting on that block of land with these titles of uh, Hori Tikuri. And no one else has those titles. I was waiting, I said on the radio, for you to bring your deeds in. I can't see any. So when I can't see any, I report back to Westminster waiting for me and the flag to take it back there to save Britain because they are affected by the same titles here, the Maori people and the Queen's Maori people. Title, it's got a stranglehold all over the world with this flag. It's a pirate's flag for pirates, not for waving around because it's got no legal effect until we put it back in. So, Yes, they're still sovereign, um, and that's their land, but not the bits of paper. Hmm. Yeah, but the papers that hold over the land, it's got the land strangled, 
and it's very difficult to go and buy your land back because that's what Charlie Hoyhip is doing, buying the land back and other people who are having a try to see if they can get the land back. I said to Kingi Todor, this is how you get your land back. Go back and follow the ship backwards. So what, uh, what Mate Parai done, he's got a, got a, they went into the mission house where the treaty was signed and because Manahi and the rest of them said he had a service there in the mission house in Mangatu, uh, Mang, uh, Ma, uh, Ma, uh, Manganunu. And so he went from there, not from Waitangi, Treaty House. He's gone from where the British ship came in first. They settled in Rawini and in uh, Farinaki. That's where the Russells and the Busbys settled. And my friend is Moira Hoffman Russell. She tells me all of this. She tells me, you Maoris, you people got screwed by my, my family. And she was in the Navy family. She's in Rotorua and she tells me, you're on track. I, I listened to her and her account of what her Navy family did. And she's from Russell, Russell, but she lived in Hokianga, in the Rawini area. And she knows every scrapping bit of what happened. And that's where the treaty, I'm checking with her, where the treaty really was signed. That's why Matapurai went from there to Britain to fill the, vo the void where the Queen went to EU Parliament. And on paper, she shifted. And she's abandoned this ship of Admiralty. Admiralty's private contract, that's the bank that makes money. The man in the magistrate court, that's what I'm acting as. I'm acting as the magistrate court. And I opened up Waitangi Marae right under their nose because Kingy says, what are you going in there for? I said, that's a Marae, isn't it? And he said, no, that's not a Marae. I said, well, I've got all my carvings from Lux Pro in there, so it must be. And then he said, I said, you own the land, I own the Marae. And that's what happened. They couldn't yeah, stop it. Yeah, mm. uh, no, no, not the ma not the Fakaminia. I'm I'm saying for Hori, Tikuri and Refere for Manukau that the British put the title on. Right? I'm only speaking for those two chiefs that the British made a contract with. Those deed documents are contracts. When your name's in capital letters, it's a contract. That makes money. You turn yourself into a contractor and two party, British and the one of those chiefs, Reverend for Manukau, has a receipt on the book. It's online. I put it on Facebook so that you can see. Mm.